Hi everybody, this is Dragon T with Dragon Fire News. Coming at you from downtown Des Moines. Trying to get to a traffic stop up the road here. Gonna cross in the crosswalks. Get up here as quickly as possible. <clears throat> See what you got going on here. <clears throat> we got Des Moines PD. Unit number 2631, traffic unit. What do you pull you over for if you don't mind me asking? Huh? Revving the engine up too much, and then I fucking brake too hard, and then I fucking. Yeah. So what's what's he calling it? Uh, just I think just pulled me over for a traffic violation. What what kind? What? Uh, I don't even know. I think he's gonna let me go though. Cool. Yeah, he's gonna let me go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's gonna let me go. Right. Just remember, you don't answer questions. Yeah, it should be. Yeah. Don't an you don't answer questions. That's all. Okay. All right. And always record your interactions with the police. Okay. Always. Okay. You, it's your right to. You got to. It's your word against theirs if you don't. Always, man. Take out your phone, put it up there on your dash, record yourself. That way you hear everything. But make sure you get his name, badge number, everything like that, too. Dragon T out here in downtown Des Moines, traffic violation. He's had wrong place, wrong time. Revved up his engines, hit the brakes or something. Don't know exactly what the cop pulled him over. He said he's gonna let him go though So we won't get in too involved Looks like we might have a lot of that here tonight what you, If you don't mind me asking, what are you doing? I'm a uh, independent journalist okay. gathering content to uh, disseminate back to the public my YouTube channel is Dragonfire News okay. uh, YouTube Dragonfire News Des Moines. Okay. That's me okay. Dragon Yep, Fire Dragonfire News. News. You'll see me yeah, I'm, I, I got about 600 subscribers trying to build them back up. Basically, is what I go out and do is make sure the cops don't violate what people's rights. Dragon, yeah. fire, yeah. news. Okay. Yeah, well, it, it'll just put Dragon Fire News. It'll pop up on YouTube. Oh, okay. You'll see. I'll see it. Yep, that's me. Okay. Subscribe. I did a cop watch down here last weekend or the weekend before. Okay. I. I work nine hour days, man, so I can only get out when I can. Yeah. But yeah, you always record the cops, man. All right, man. Yeah, thanks. Definitely. Thanks, yep. Definitely. Appreciate it. We got car number, I said, what was it? 2631? Yep. 2631. Let's see if we can get it. Close up of the officer here, right in his citation. I don't see any stripes. Yeah, man. Spread the word for me. Like, share, and subscribe, man. Get your friends out there. Remember, even another thing is you don't even have to give them your license. By law, all it says is present. So you, I was, my lawyer says, roll your window down this far, yeah. put your license, Registration and insurance to the window, they got to take do their investigation and write it down. That's according to what my lawyer says because the law says you only have to present. You only have to present so much, huh? You only have to present it. They have to, all they have to do is see it, they don't have to actually take possession of it. And if you're walking and not in a vehicle yeah. and a cop pulls up and asks you for your name and identification, 
don't give it to them. I don't answer questions, and I don't, uh, unless you suspect me, of, if you have reasonable, articulate suspicion that I've committed a crime, about to commit a crime, or in the process of crime, I don't have to identify. There is no failure to identify in a statute in the state of Iowa. They would, they, they, they'll try to say it's, it's uh, obstructing justice, but it's not your, you do not have to, you don't have to talk to the cops and tell, give them information. You don't have to uh, perjure yourself, you know what I mean? You don't, just don't answer questions, period. Yep. Sweet. Much love, yes, definitely. I'm here for the people, not for not for uh, them. I'm here to record them and make sure they don't violate us. They're our public servants. All right, man, he's coming back to you, so I got to get back. All right, thank you. I can't impede. Emergency lights are off. And notice he, after, after he, he, he cites you and gives you tickets, he tries to act like your friend. Hey, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm going to pirate your car, give you tickets, take money from you, and then say, hey, uh, got to get some rims on that car. It'd make it look cooler. <laughs> <Yeah>. oh, <laughs> Try right. to be your friend, man. That's funny. Oh, that's fucked 
I'm going to take money from you, take you to court, possibly take your license away if you don't get it taken care of. And then, but hey, man, nice car. You need to get some rims on it, got some possible damage. Yeah, they try to be your friend. That's funny. Protect and serve. You're more like road pirates. The, there's another car out here. I'm not sure. I think it was, uh, uh, he's got uh, plate readers on it. Four, four pl license plate readers on it. So he, I guarantee you what happened is, is he got your ta hit you with the license plate reader, saw you were suspended, told told who the cop, one of the other patrol officers, because he won't pull you over directly. The, the plate reader won't. But Looks like this officer's done. So, so what, what's his uh, name, name, dude? If you don't look mind looking at the ticket and tell me. Uh, yeah, I'll know. When you get a chance. Yeah, you can get I chance. would ask him, but. Uh, probably be an ask for you. Yeah. Especially since yeah, I'm. Cool. He, he seems cool. right. I could always FOIA information the request if I wanted to, but then they, then they charge you for it. They. And this is another way for them to make a profit. <laughs> Not yet. Get right up in there. Damn, I can almost read his badge number. I gotta stabilize my camera though. I gotta get it up higher. You wanna know his name? Yeah, name and badge number of him, this officer. He's an older officer, so. Yeah, he didn't say nothing to me. No, no, you did. It should be uh, oh, oh. C citing oh, officer. Brian Foster. What? Brian Foster. Brian Foster, is he a sergeant, uh, corporal? Uh, I don't know, it just says that. I think he's number 5245. 5245? Yeah. Sweet, thank you, man. Uh, I'm going to let you get. Uh, get back to doing what you got to do because I'm sure you want to clean some stuff out before they you're getting someone to come pick your car up right yeah. all right well I'm gonna head on down here and down the road peace like share and subscribe brother just out of curiosity having a good night officer I'm working working huh yeah. all right Are you having a good night yep my first stop of the night first stop of the night yep I'll, I'll, I'll be catching you on some more, I'm sure. Okay. <laughs> Just out of curiosity, could I get you to uh, identify name and badge number? Foster, 5245. 5245 Foster. Thank you, officer. Have a good evening. Yep, you too. This officer, regardless, he did. He let him go. He could actually took him to jail on driving on suspension, so he gave him sight, court appearance. So I, I would say Foster, granted, victimless crime, but you, you do the crime, you gotta pay the fine, I guess, right? According to them, traffic laws. Sucks. All right, head on down here and see if we can't get into another interaction. Okay, ooh, Corvette. Love the Corvette. So I'm going to come out here and see if I can't get some good footage of some cars going by. What do we got? Another vet? Ah. Officer. Uh, unit number, I can't tell. Yeah, get to it. Cherries and berries, baby. You gotta get to the cherries and berries. <laughs> Another one. Right.
sucks to have COPD. Evening. Go, Not bad. There's one of the most things. Ah, oh, shit! I ain't gonna get there in time. That sucks. Hey, I'm gonna. They're out thick tonight. Oh, fuck. Wow. 17 minutes. I couldn't get to... So there's two stops, one right after the other right there. That was crazy. See if I can't find some more. I guess you can't get them all. How's it going, guys? There's another one right there already. Boom. Just wait a minute and you'll see another one. What's he doing? Oh, does he got him? Huh. 
There's another one. See, I told you. And that one's turning left. Fuck. <sighs> Just came from here. And I thought fleecing for profit was bad in Chicago. Well, off he goes. Didn't even get a chance to get there. How's it going? Right here's another one. Jesus. See one, you see a bunch. I just seen four cops in a matter of five minutes down here policing for profit. Uh, another one way down there. Tell me they ain't harassing the Des Moines, the, uh, the citizens of Des Moines, Iowa. Well, now the lights are off. I wish I had a driver. God, I wish I had a driver. Fuck, this is insane. How's it going, guys? Check 370Z or 350, one of the two. Oh shit, we zoomed down. It's freaking ridiculous. <laughs> Pontiac GTO what does it look like just a bunch of blurry headlights coming at us <laughs> Conley Security. What's his name was talking about Conley. There comes an officer there. Strolling through. Ta ta ta. Not supposed to do that, officer. Ta-ta! Better to one now. Let's see if I can get there before he uh, 
gets away. See the cherries and berries over there. I wonder what that's all about. The thing about this is I can cut through the park. Got one sitting over there and one sitting right there. No lights on. Incognito. Let's go get this one first. See if we can't. Oh, see, you can chase them off. 2669, let's get the license plate number. Oh, let's see if we can't get that CAD. Oh, right up in the CAD. What's that? Oh, he's running, got plate numbers on there. What? Running plate numbers, what the hell? All right, let's run your plate number. That officer had plate numbers. He was running plate numbers. Where's the... Let's find the ta tag reader. Tag reader's out here somewhere. He, they're, he's feeding information to the other officers. Let's get, hurry up and get over here and get this officer. Yeah, he was reading tags. He was running tags. When I came walking up. I looked at his CAD with my other camera. I could see it. I'll have to, once I figure out how to edit with my one camera and use the other camera, I'll do more visuals on the CADs. But for now, let's see what this officer's doing over here. Seems to be keeping an eye on what's going on up the road here. So we'll, we'll go scare them off for everybody. This isn't the tag reader car though. Unit number 2631 traffic. License plate 120076. Hey guys, Woo! they want to be on camera. We'll, we'll throw them on camera. Sweet, look at them, yeah. All right, I got you guys. Dragon Fire News, YouTube. That's where you'll see yourselves. YouTube, Dragon Fire News. It'll be posted tomorrow. All right. Uh, that's what I do. Huh? What's the cop doing that's so cool? Um, just basically making sure he viol uh, doesn't violate people's rights. I don't think he's doing anything, but he's just sitting there. No, but he's also on um, ta taxpayers' dollars just sitting here. Well, he's making sure nobody speaks. No. That's a victimless crime, my friend. Victimless crime. It's not. It's called a traffic infraction. It's actually not a crime. No, look it up. It's actually not a, uh, it's a traffic infraction. It's not a crime. Nope. I'm an independent journalist, man. Yeah, I do make money, man. Yep. And when they pull you over and ask you for your ID in the state of Iowa, you don't have to provide your ID. Bill, you don't identify the cops. They're public servants, man. I won't get shot. Do you realize the city of Des Moines just tried to uh, prosecute a journalist on for being outside doing uh, public photography? They tried to prosecute a Drake uh, Des Moines uh, registered journalist during the time of the uh, the uh, pro uh, protest. 
She wasn't breaking the law. She was out covering a story and they arrested her. That's stupid. They're on Na Des Moines, Iowa's on uh, Des Moines PD's on national news right now because of how they treat the media. So I, I come out and film them. That's my right. It's my constitutional right. That's right. I'll do me. And you do you. Keep licking their boots. Yep. 13 viewers. All right. <laughs> That's why they're out here with a vehicle with a tax with the tag readers on it. Yep, there's another one. See? Another road pirate. Road pirate. What? Oh, they're just road pirates. They're the uh, do you real the, these guys over here are being bootlickers. But right now what they're doing is they're going around. And they got a car out here with uh, tag readers reading people's license plates. And they feed that information to the other officers. And then those other officers that find va uh, violations in your t from your license plates pull you over and either arrest you or cite you. Oh. It's a, basically a traffic scam. See, look how many of them there are. I, we, we've seen... Like, like, I, don't, I don't know that much about like, law. Well, like, the, the law... It? Is this wrong? Yeah, yeah, it is wrong. It's basically, it's a violation. They're our public servants. They work for us. They're not supposed to, uh, to, uh, uh, to take from us. They're not supposed to do anything to violate our rights. And freedom of movement is our right. Yeah. And unless we've broken the law, they should have no reason to run our license plates, no reason to bother us. But they're out here, like I said, if you drive around more than four or five times, they read your tags and then pull you over for whatever reason they feel like. That's, weird. that's, called that's, a tra why, they just, they just that's why we call them road pirates. They're probably just trying to like, get their quotas over something. Well, uh, just get more money. More, that's, uh, more money to bu uh, budget their 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 non constitutional. I feel like some of the people that pull over. What? <laughs> he asked me a question. Like they're taking I think. money from like the citizens. Yeah, taking. They're stealing money from the citizens, basically. So, but I also I also cover fires. You know, anything that I can I can go and film when I'm out here. But mainly, I'd come out and try to catch the cops by breaking people's, violating people's rights. But see, I, you're going to have people like this over here that think the cops are good and they're there for there to protect them. But they're not your friends. They're there to uh, either violate your rights and get money from you, and be authoritarian. And